Welcome everyone to our weekly video. It's hard to believe that we're now at the last day of September, uh, but I'm here with a dear friend of mine for 30 plus years. We met actually in Europe, in Ireland, and then in Italy together, but Dr. Diane Traplett, a well-renowned speaker, a member of our faculty at Seton Hall University at the seminary, author of many books, retreat uh, director on numerous, numerous occasions, and we're so lucky to have her back here again. She's gonna lead our annual Women's Weekend Retreat. And so Diane, thank you. And if you could just share a little bit with our parishioners what they can expect on the retreat. Sure, thank you so much. First of all, thank you for the invitation. Of course. Thank you for inviting me back into your spiritual family because I have been here a few times. I spoke at the uh, parish mission once mm -hmm. or twice. I've given lectures here. I've given the women's retreat once already. So I feel like I'm being welcomed back into my family. So thank you very much for that. And you often come to 615 Mass. We see you here, yes, which is always a joy. That's right, yes, it is a joy. Yeah. So when I think of this parish family, I do think of Joyce. When I was asked to, to consider giving the retreat, I thought, Let, let's, let's speak about joy. Mm. And, um, you know, there are definitely stresses in our lives. There are definitely times when we're suffering. Mm -hmm. And can we speak about joy even in those times? So I'd like to reconsider joy and look at the lives of some of the great saints. You and I both love Sister Teresa Benedicta of the Cross. The cross. And she even had cross in her name, and yet there was a sense of joy. Mm -hmm. So I want to just kind of tap into how can people find joy in their daily life, no matter what they're going through, no matter what season of life they're in, how can we find joy? So I'd like to give an acronym. Uh, I'm allowed to hear because at the seminary they're tired of all my acronyms. <laughs> <laughs> but I want you to think about a pep in your step. Pep so in pep. Step. Okay. Um, P is for purpose, E is for encounter, and P is for peace. So a person of joy, you're going to find that that mm. person has a sense of purpose. Very good. And yep. it's a purpose from God. They understand God has put them in this place for a reason mm -hmm. and at this particular time in history. Um, and then you go about trying to fulfill that purpose even in the difficult times. E is encounter. And that's that's where it all begins. Mm. What is your encounter with God? So that, that joy journal that you mentioned. Joy journal is how am I finding God in my daily life, mm -hmm. how am I encountering God? God delights in us, do we delight in finding God? So let's take a look at how do we encounter God in our daily lives? And then P is that sense of peace. This mm -hmm. isn't a happiness that's, that's superficial or shallow. This is a deep sense of peace that I'm in the harbor of, of God's will. Beautiful, wow. I, now I want to go to this retreat as well. I mean, I will be there for a little bit to help out with confessions and other things like that. But as you can tell, Diane is a deeply spiritual, wonderful person. Besides being a friend for so many years, she has guided and helped so many people grow closer to Christ. Um, and that's what I'm sure will happen because he is the source of all of our joy. And the retreat is November 1st second, third, starts on a Friday, ends on a Sunday. Um, we are asking you to reserve, to make your reservation by mid-October. So please, if you have any questions, reach out to Tina Smith or reach out to our parish office. Um, but I'm excited for everyone. And where is it going to be? I, I know I should know this, but too much information is in my head. <laughs> <laughs> Tina, can you help us out here? <laughs> Tina's off camera, but Tina, help us. Where? Don Bosco Retreat Center on the Marion Shrine. Very good, and Haverstraw. Yeah, yeah I, no, I just blanked. Stony Point. In Stony Point, but it's in that same yeah, area, same area. The, all the information is there. But which... what's important to know is that part of it will be outdoors. So I'm really happy that we're having this conversation outdoors. Outdoors, yeah. And beauty is part of, of joy too. So Amen. we're gonna look into that as well. It just didn't work with yeah. my acronym, Pep. Yeah, no, exactly, <laughs> exactly. And I think the Don Bosco thing, it just it probably had a hard time in my own Bergen Catholic mind, but, um, <laughs> but it's a beautiful retreat center area and it's not too far away. Stony Point is such a beautiful place, just up uh, New York State a little bit. So please, please, any questions, reach out to Tina or our office. Diane, as always, thank you. Thank you, thank you for doing yeah. this. And It'll parishioners, we'll see you at church. And if you come to 615, you might see Diane. <laughs> Bye. Bye. Bye.